right, good evening, everybody. Welcome to Community Focus here in Nelson County on Channel 6 TV. I'm Kenny Fogel, your host tonight. Glad you could join us. We'll be talking about something that's been going on in Nelson County and Bardstown for, well, about 41 years now. It's quite a tradition, and uh, it's sort of the way we mark the beginning of summer here. One of those, we always were loaded with festivals, as you know. So we love, love our festivals here in Bardstown and Nelson County, and uh, this is basically one of the first ones of the year, and that's the Wine and Cheese Tasting Festival, but on by the Rotary Club, Bardstown Rotary Club. And with us today is the uh, well, the incoming president will be president here in a few month, a few weeks, I guess so. Uh, yep. Howard Keene the, with the Rotary Club, and one of the first official duties of the person coming in as president of the Rotary Club is to be in charge of the wine and cheese tasting festival. So, Howard, welcome to the show. Thanks a lot. And I know the wine and cheese tasting festival is something that's probably been bearing on your mind for more than just a day. Well, that's true, <laughs> true. But actually, I'm pretty lucky. We've got some really good committee chairs that. Do a lot of good work and we've been doing it for so long it's almost on autopilot now yeah yeah so yeah but yeah the this year's festival will be on june 4th it's our 41st festival and it's basically going to be the same as years in the past uh, you know we'll have about 20 or so wines we'll have some beer too um, it's 30 dollars with an advance ticket uh, 35 at the gate you can get your tickets at clark's jeweler jewelers kenny's cleaners the tourist commission uh, the Standard, Medica Pharmacy, and Conway Heaton. And from any Rotarian. Any Rotarian, look, that's look right. me and you up, that's boy. Right. That's I've right. got a stack of tickets out in my car right now. It's burning to get to somebody. So if you happen to run into one of us, we'll be more than happy to sell you a ticket. But there'll be tickets for sale at the door that night, just a little that's bit right. more. But uh, the thing about the wine and cheese is that, and it is a, it's a definite wine and cheese tasting because it is, you got wine from all over the world. Don't That's you? right. Yeah, we have some you know imported wines, California wines. We'll have some Kentucky wines too. Uh, we do have cheeses there too, and some, and some fruit. We do have some new cheeses coming in this year, which I'm looking forward to, mm -hmm. to seeing that. Um, you know, so it, it. But what's the best part of that event is this, everybody walking around the lawn and spotting hall and visiting and talking, and it's just a beautiful setting. And we pray there's no rain. <laughs> we do have a, a, a alternative for rains. We can go through the Guthrie Opportunity Center. But it's a whole lot more fun if we can have it, it outside. Is. It is. Just like a Marshdown homecoming in a way. Because you see people that you haven't seen in a while. It just seems like just about everybody shows up. That's right. And, you know, we also are getting a huge uh, crowd in town with the Kentucky Bourbon Trail. And, uh, and some of them find out about it at the last minute. And they, they buy tickets and come in, too. Mm -hmm. yeah. And... I mean, well, it's a big, first of all, it's one of the best fundraisers the Rotary Club has all year. You've got a silent auction and a live auction. That's right. And all the proceeds uh, go towards our club, but the main part of, of, the, of the proceeds goes to our eight scholarships that we give out every year. Uh, we give a $1,000 scholarship to graduating seniors, and um, so that, that's really a great cause. And it's also a fundraiser for the American Heart Association as well, too. One of the things I've noticed about Rotary Club is, I mean, you I don't say you're constantly giving out money, but there's a lot of recipients of grants from the Rotary Club, and this, without fundraisers like this, I mean, it's got to run out of money sometime. That's right. Well, we're fortunate. We do have two pretty good fundraisers, three fundraisers, really. Uh, we have this event. We also sell uh, drink tickets and, and, and beer and bourbon at the Bourbon Festival, and we also um, participate in the street concert as well. Oh. So we do raise a lot of money. We're, we're probably one of the leading uh, clubs in, in our region as far as raising money. Mm -hmm. So we have a lot of money to give, but we do also ask everybody to make a formal presentation. We don't just hand out checks. Yeah. We make them come earn it first. <laughs> Gotta come and earn it. <laughs> well, about this uh, wine and cheese tasting, I know one of the complaints that we have heard recently is uh, people sneaking in or somebody coming in not paying their money. Now, you're trying to uh, fix that this year. Yeah, I'm glad you brought that up. This year we are gonna uh, have uh, wristbands to put on you. So if, if we see you walking around and don't have a wristband on, we're going to just politely ask you to go up front and, and, and pay your entry fee. Oh, we're going to toss you. No, we're going to toss you. We're going to have you pay your entry fee. <laughs> okay, no tossing. <laughs> I'm sort of looking forward to the tossing part. But, uh, but, uh, so, again, it's good. a lot going on with the wine and cheese. It's like I said, a lot of people are having fun. It all goes to a good cause. There's no downside to that. There's really not. So let's well, talk about the Rotary Club for a few minutes. Right now, I think it's around 40, 41 people. And That's it's, correct. It fluctuates up and down. Right. Y'all are looking for new members. We're always looking for new members. And, you know, we're fortunate that we've had some very long-term members, long-standing members. But, you know, 
those those guys and ladies get, get tired. Mm -hmm. So we're always looking for new blood to, to kind of take new roles and, and provide new leadership. And so, yeah, we're, we're always looking for new members. And the hardest thing they have to do is show up to lunch. That's once right. We, 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 we meet on, <laughs> on Wednesdays at noon at the public library, and there's a full meal provided, and it's always a good meal. The 30, 41st, 41st, yeah. I can't do That's that. That's a long 41st. time. Wine and Cheese Tasting Festival, sponsored by the Bartstown Rotary Club, again, June 4th. It's on Saturday night, 6.30 to 9 o'clock, $30 in advance, $35 at the door. And we'd love to see you there. So how are we? There. We appreciate you doing all this. I know it's got, like you say, you got a good people working yeah, with you, yeah. but it's still a lot of responsibility. That's right. Yeah. And you'll make the decision that morning or about when, yeah. if the weather. We, we decide by 10 o'clock Saturday morning if it's going to be moved inside, if it's bad weather. And we'll post it uh, on the sign there at Spalding Hall and also try to get out to the press too. And then Facebook or anywhere yeah. else. So if you want to be, and that's another thing, go on to Bartstown Rotary Club and like them on Facebook. Yeah. And you can keep up with all the stuff that's going on. Even go to web page bartstownrotaryclub.org so there's all kinds of ways you can stay in touch find out might be somebody in the club that you even like you might want to hang out <laughs> with so if you want to join as a dues are not that much so you might as well just to give it a chop again barstown rotary club every, you know there's a lot of rotary clubs around here i know yeah. every county i think just about has one mm -hmm. We've got a state convention coming up here in the next week or so so we, i think they do yeah so a lot of camaraderie in that, and a lot of yeah, and, and training too that makes sure that you, you're you're you learn how to, to run your chapter properly because you know they don't want a new president coming in and running a successful chapter into the ground. Yeah. So they want to make sure you, you get off to a good start. All right. Well, Howard Keene here with the Marchstown Rotary Club, the incoming president of the Rotary Club, and also in charge of the wine and cheese tasting this year. So show up and show Howard how much uh, how, how well everything's good and how much you enjoy it and stop in and have a good time. Appreciate you being here. Thanks a lot. All right, stick around. A lot more to come <laughs> right after this message is here on Channel 6 TV. We'll be right back.